Access Gate Airways Flight 117, struck by unexplained lightning. No one's talking about anything else right now. We might be looking at the real deal. I've got the good stuff for you this time. Passenger simply vanishing from an aircraft mid-flight. Does that sound possible to you? Antonio Zapatero, otherwise known as Rabbit. He's a courier who only carries real blood. This one promised to provide evidence after being brought to Boston. Evidence that may well have led to the ID of the source of real blood. But then the lightning struck, and in the confusion, he vanished. He escaped somehow? No. When I say vanished, that's pretty much what I mean. Like something out of a magic act. So, clue me in. What makes this one the real deal? The name of the boss he was going to give up? apparently starts with the letter D. This courier might have had evidence revealing the identity of D. So, interested yet? Let me ask you again. A passenger simply vanishing from an aircraft mid-flight. Does that sound possible to you? No, it's impossible. There's someone pulling the strings behind this mystery. Right on the money, David. The third party most likely used the confusion to spirit the courier away. Lots of people want the evidence he was carrying after all. From the evidence I was able to bring, this particular item is the most interesting. The owner of that badge was involved in this incident. Well? No doubt about it. This is a memento. Great. It's yours, then. Let's hope it's the last one you'll ever need. I can't get 
How come you like me? We Turians haven't exactly treated Krogan very well. You aren't like most Turians, Petra. You know what it's like to hurt a little. I haven't taken half the shots you have. Here we are. You ready? <laughs> You were right. The view is great from up here. We're not even to the top yet. Come on, I'll race you. A race? Up this cliff? Less talk, more climb. Let's go, Pathfinder. And no jump jets. No one likes a cheat. This isn't fair. You're taller. You have reach. Staying within your limits is no fun, Ryder. Having fun? See? Not fair. <laughs> wow. It's all going to be like this, huh? No. Better. For 14 months, I wondered if I'd made a mistake coming here and dragging my sister with me. I don't wonder anymore. Boarding the Tempest that day was the best decision I ever made. It's been a wild ride, huh? Wouldn't exchange it for any other. A great shot. Writes poetry, souls. <clears throat> Mother. <laughs> I'm late for a resistance meeting. Stay clear. Your mother's in the resistance? <laughs> yes. And every child is her favorite. Everyone, this is Ryder. Hi. Look who the car can drag to. Welcome back. This is where I spent most of my days growing up. Me, my sister, Guan, our cousin, Etta, and brother, Finn. Then, Bavezil, Rolu. So wonderful to Ejal, have you back. A human. Jal, you bring in someone special to meet us. Wow. Cozy. We like to live like this. Gonna give your friends some real food? Good to see you. And here's my room. My... Tiny sanctuary. We have a saying that I like. Home is where the heart is. <laughs> I like that. Oh, no. Who put this here? Schematics? Of... When I was seven, my aunt stole a cat weapon for me. So I... Took it apart. To learn. And that is... was... a Karkin. Pet Karkin. <laughs> Alfit. He died. So I also... took him apart. To... learn? Why not? I never show people these things, 
but I feel like we're family. I'm glad Ephra threw you on my ship. Hey, there's one more thing you might like. Sit there. Been interesting so far. Nice. You made that? Long ago. It's not accurate. More of a dream, really. Just one more thing I want to take apart and figure out. Me too, Jal. Me too. <laughs>